Welcome everybody to Enlisted. This is a very special game to me. And I would say I started playing about three years ago at the very start of closed Moscow beta on uh, Xbox. That's right, I started out as a console gamer on Enlisted. It was during a time I didn't have a PC. But man, did this game get me through to the time I could get a PC. And now I started a PC account. Completely free, of course, this one. Um, I would say on my console I have over 78 days worth of battle time. Probably 80 by now. And just about everything collected. So, uh, I, I can tell you, this is it's had ups and downs through the years. But I think finally it's gotten to a really good place, you know. Let's take, for instance, uh, the merch. Since what's been commonly referred to as the merch. A lot of the new players, a lot of you new players won't even know what that is. Well, before everything was systemized into a campaign system. Everything was divided and you go to a certain campaign. Now everything's merged with pretty good battle rating. And it's been an... Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? constructive process to get there to where it is now so the silver economy has just been changed making it much easier to get silver completely affordable and having research so this makes it so much easier to zoom through, the, zoom through this tree like I'm already in tier 3 essentially so you know you can get different units the cool thing about this game, like the really, the, the catch that really got me about this game was that you were, you know, I, growing up I played a game called, uh, I always want to say Band of Brothers, and forgive me for saying this, but if not Band of Brothers, but I think, I think, you know, Brothers in Arms, Brothers in Arms, that was a great game. And this kind of reminded me of that. It's nowhere near as tactical. In fact, it's much more akin, closer to Call of Duty and just spray and pray and, and the way it's played. But it's fun nonetheless. Like, you get, uh, depending on which kind of squad, how many different squads, different classes. You know, you get all the different weapons of World War II essentially even prototypes a lot of prototypes when you get like the gold stuff right here yeah some of these weapons condors is really good all the good weapon all the regular weaponry of course you can get all the way down to the STG 44 for Germany you know it's you know America Japan sorry about that Japan, Germany, America, and the Soviet Union. But also in America is England. Also in Germany is Italy. All in all, it's, it's pretty fun. Like the, the upgrade tree, you know, there's so many sinks in this game to keep you going for a while. You know, just uh, simply upgrading stuff. Personal upgrades, the weapon upgrades, and the research little folders in here. We go, you go all the way down. You know, you where you got like the Tiger Twos here, the STGs in the late war, the Star War, and all the premium stuff down here. You know, and nothing's really pay to win, right? Like there, there's very few squads I would say that's very pay to win, and most of those are essentially off the market point but uh yeah so this is enlisted you know it's it's a pretty fun game it's, uh, let me show you some gameplay like the best way to play is to be bold Once you get to tier two, these are the most important thing. AP mines. So 
Sometimes being bold. Sometimes being bold pays off, as you can see. See anything. That's enlisted, folks. Thanks for watching.